Hey guys, in today's Logic Pro X quick tip, I'm gonna show you probably the most valuable tip that saved me time and helped my workflow so much in Logic Pro X, and I wish I learned this earlier. So it's not that exciting, but when you're moving around your session, most of the time you end up coming up here and you do this to zoom up or down and then zoom in or zoom out. It's not it doesn't it's not the end of the world to come up here, but there's a much faster way to do it. So if you're using the Apple mouse, you can hold option and then swipe left to zoom out or right to zoom in and then swipe up to make the waveform smaller or swipe down to make the waveforms go in. So then as I'm scrolling through here and then I want to zoom in, I hold option up or down or left or right and it just speeds up your workflow so much. I can't tell you how much that made me work faster instead of coming up here and doing these manually. The other option you have if you don't have a mouse like that or a trackpad, you can hold command and use the arrows to move in. So command and down moves like that. Command right zooms in, left zooms out, up makes it smaller, down makes it bigger. But I like the option and the mouse. It just speeds everything up so much faster. And then just a quick bonus one, if you, the shortcut Z will zoom in on whatever you've clicked on. So if I want to just see this waveform and I hit Z, it zooms in on the entire waveform, hit Z and it'll go back to where it was. There's another shortcut, Command A to select everything, and then Z to see your entire session, which is incredibly valuable. Or if I just want to see this session, just hit Z and now that fills my screen. So that's just a super quick way to navigate much faster in Logic Pro X. And again, it has saved me so much time. So hope that helped you guys out. It helped me out a lot. Figured I'd share it with you guys. If you want to see more Logic Pro quick tips like this in the future, don't forget to subscribe to my channel as I try to post one of these about every Saturday. Don't forget to check out some of my other Logic Pro quick tips by watching the playlist on the screen. Check out how I do backing tracks in Logic and run an entire show with Logic by checking out the playlist on the screen as well. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys, and I'll see you next time.